Even as the Pentagon field its fifth-generation fighter of choice, the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter, the Navy and the U.S. Air Force along with industry are looking at what comes next. This sixth-generation fighter initiative is loosely known as the FX program for the USAF and the FIXX for the Navy. The FX program looks to to finally replace the F-15 Eagle, as well as the F-22 Raptor, and the FIXX program aims to replace the FA-18EF Super Hornet. This new aircraft will be as much about reusable weaponry lasers as it is about expendable weaponry. Development of solid-state airborne laser capability is already well underway in the white world, and has most likely experienced other application gains in the black world. The idea is that combat aircraft can use solid-state laser systems defensively, creating a sanitized sphere of safety around the aircraft. Shooting down or critically damaging incoming missiles and approaching aircraft with their laser turrets. They can also use such a system offensively, leveraging their stealth capabilities to sneak up on enemy aircraft and striking with speed of light accuracy. Even attacking targets on the ground, such as individual people, with pinpoint precision. Or shooting down ballistic missiles and other targets traditionally relegated to larger and much more complex ground or sea-based weapon systems, are possibilities. The introduction of nibble and compact lasers on the aerial battlefield will likely allow fighter-sized combat aircraft designs to cease putting a premium on maneuverability, as lasers are speed of light weapons. In other words, as long as the enemy can be detected and is within the laser's range, they are at risk of being fried regardless of how hard they try to evade via hard turns and other high-G maneuvers. Countermeasures will become more about evading initial detection, staying outside an opposing aircraft's laser's envelope, and confusing targeting sensors than outmaneuvering the adversary. In other words, the duog fights of the future will look nothing like they do today. One issue pointed out by Northrop Grumman is that these lasers, along with future engines and avionics, will put out a huge amounts of heat, making thermal control a huge concern for stealthy aircraft. Infrared search and track systems, both air and ground-based, are only becoming more sensitive and reliable as time goes on. As a result, future stealthy fighter aircraft will have to keep their cool in order to remain undetected over the battlefield.